Okay, having some computer issues, so hopefully we'll get through it. <laughs> it is an official way in video, week 69, because 68 was unofficial, and I am up one pound from the last time that I weighed in at Weight Watchers. I am down 4.2 from my last weigh-in video, which is pretty crazy. My weight is uh, 136.2, just fine, and uh, it's been crazy. Let's just go. All right, so that was my weigh-in. I'll recap a couple things. Um, what you don't know is that I am now employed by Weight Watchers. What? Yeah, that. Friday, I had an interview, and I'm going to be working my local meeting as the receptionist, and the plan is for me to become the leader once other positions are full. So, that's fun. That's exciting. Uh, I am really excited. I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm really excited. Um, number two, the, the scale giveaway is going to change a little bit. We're going to extend it. I'm not 100% sure how long. And um, I'm going to do that because I just got in touch, the company just got in touch with me and was asking how things were going, and she wanted to be able to promote it also. So I'm going to give her the link, and we're going to extend it um, till I guess, um, we'll do the end of September. So there we go. And then um, also I'm going to put giveaway in the title because that's, you know, it's the company is doing it, so I can't, you know. Anyway, <laughs> um, so that is that, right? So far, yes. Weight Watchers is going to be changing a couple of things, and I don't know this because I'm an employee. I know this because I was sitting myself in the meeting, um, and my leader told me, told us, the whole group, that they are doing some research on the fact that we all get 29 points, at the end because they're finding that that might be too high a point goal for petite people towards the end of their journey. Keep that in mind. They're also talking about the free fruits because they're finding that people might be kind of abusing it. Who said that? Hello. Um, I'll keep you guys posted. If the sound in this video is messed up, I apologize. Oh, the banana. I've recorded a video and I recorded a video for the banana with the banana and then it got erased and she's not here. So I'm just going to let you know the banana lost two pounds this week, which means that in three weeks she's lost 6.7 pounds for the banana. All right, guys. I'm going to cut this one short. Um, there will be a food vlog today. Uh, oh, that's it. My God. I'm on my period. Sorry, boy. And it is fucking insane up in this bitch, okay? Like, I, the past two days, like this weekend, gave myself permission to eat, even to overeat a bit, because um, I try to stick between 14, 1600 calories. 18 is like my maintenance point, but I was like, you know what? If I go over that, that's okay, because I am starving, going ballistic. Um, and, and, you know, today is actually a much better day, but it was like insanity. And I can only imagine that the reason I noticed, because before I used to eat whatever the hell I wanted anyway, and so I never thought about what it was I was desiring, but my gosh, it's just insane. And I'm, I'm doing some research on foods and stuff because it just seems like there's got to be something to be done about that. And I will say that one thing that I found was an article that talked about um, carbs, which, you know, are something that a lot of times carbs and sweets or carbs and salt or whatever. Um, and they suggested oatmeal. And today I actually used oatmeal in my plan. And it has been a much better day. So I guess starting off with a big carb kick kept me from wanting them all day long. So yay for that. I'll let you know any information that I come up with and how it works for me. And oh, somebody asked me about um, what 
I use for counting calories, and that's LoseIt.com. I think they're fabulous and free and amazing and wonderful, so you should go check them out. And, uh, yeah, that'll be it. Now we're going to wrap it up, and I will talk to you guys later.